Hello, this is Tiho at NAM 2016, and we are here with Victor Wooten. Um, this is such a pleasure, such an honor for us to have you. Um, we're Intertalk Radio, and uh, Pitbull Audio is here um, have, giving us the equipment so we can do these interviews. Um, but we'd love to hear about how things are going and also about Fodera. Sure, yeah. I've been using these fine instruments since 1983, uh, and I love them. You know, for me, they're, they're the best for what I like to do. And uh, they're still handmade. And uh, I have a couple of o over here that, that uh, I've been involved in helping make. One on the far left is the, the yin yang bass. I just, many years ago, I wanted a bass that looked like a yin yang symbol. And so Vinny figured out a way of taking two pieces of wood and matching them together and making it beautiful. Yeah. And the other one over here, second from the right, is a prototype. It's a brand new thing that we call the bow bass. This, is, this one is a five string with a curved fingerboard that I actually bow. And I always wanted an instrument, from playing cello as a kid, I wanted an instrument that had sustain, like a bow. But I didn't want to have to turn it upright. Yeah. So I can actually, while I'm holding it this way, bow vertically up and down and get a beautiful sustain sound. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's so it's wonderful. Cool. Yeah, I got to hear that sometime. I don't think I've really heard the bass being played with a bow. <laughs> no, I'm sure you haven't. Not a, you know, an electric bass. We're used to the double bass or the cello. Yes, yes. But this is a new thing. You know, whether people pick up on it and start doing it, that's up to them. But it was something that I wanted, and I'm lucky to have people like Vinny Fodera who can build anything. Yeah, yeah. That is really wonderful. And uh, what what is your next gig? What is the next thing up for you, Victor? Yeah, right now, um, well, I, what I just finished was playing that bass. That's why it's here. I did a, a bass concerto with the uh, Chicago Symphony. So I was out there with the Sinfonietta, and we did two performances over Martin Luther King Holiday. So I just came from that, um, and now I'm going to go teach a week at Berklee College of Music and then do a few shows in Boston and New York. All right. Victor, thank you so very much for spending some time with us. It's like the last hour of NAMM 2016, and uh, he was very kind to give us a little bit, a little bit more of his time um, to do this interview. Thank you so very much. I appreciate it. Thanks for speaking with me. All right. This is Enter Talk Radio, and we are presenting gear previews um, hosted by Pitbull Audio. Thank you. <laughs>